Hello beautiful people who are Rambo au Rambo. Karibuni sana. I am Priscilla and welcome to our channel. For today's video I want to show you how you can achieve this look. I love it. This right here is a look I would wear if I want to say hi, I am approachable. Hi, I love harmony. Hi, I love people and I love interacting with people. Hi, I love to love. Yes. And if you want to know how you can achieve this look, keep watching. Hello beautiful people, how you doing today? Warembo wa Warembo mnaendelea aje. Mimi niko salama and today we want to just let's let me just show you how you can achieve this in very few minutes. To start off, I'm going to be using my Kama Kawaida Green Essence of Day Cream. This cream is amazing. I mentioned in another video that it has a really nice scent that I like. So yeah, I use that as my moisturizer. Then I put my balm. Hey, this video is like fast forwarded proper. <laughs> But you can see what I'm doing, making my uh, my hair to hairlines, etc, etc. Of course, I'm going to start with my eyebrows and um, we just work on the brows. I've done many videos on how you can do your eyebrows. Some videos I use the gel. For this particular video, I am using the Davis pencil and this pencil costs, I think, 40 bob, 30 bob, 50 bob, depending on where you're buying it. And you all know we have to fill in our brows because the eyebrows play such a huge role in making sure that our face is framed, you know, like it just gives us a really nice frame. And um, now I feel like I'm talking like my son because he's the one who teaches me things and he's like, mommy, so now, <laughs> so anyway, so now we are going to work on our, on the, you know, under the brows, defining them, making sure they are very neat. I'm using a concealer. You can use a foundation if you like. You can use a, the mix, a mixture of both concealer and foundation. And by the way, why do we find our eyebrows? Yeah, we define them so that they just look so neat. Especially for this video, uh, you know, I find this very essential because you're not going to be doing a lot. You're not going to be putting um, false lashes. And we're not doing like a heavy highlight and uh, shading thingy. So I think we can work on the brows, make sure they look bomb, you know because you know yeah you get the whole idea just work on your eyebrows and make sure they look good and when you're working on your upper brow <laughs> you will need to rewind this video like three times especially if you're first timer because you have to do it and then you do it again the key thing here is use the right brush like what i'm using this is called an angled brush it is specific for the it's specifically for the eyebrows and then you'll need to just you know slant it the way you are comfortable you can also use an eyeshadow brush but the key key thing here is be comfortable eka mkono ju eka kando eka position yoyote so long as you're able to do it right and if the top part really gives you stress please watch an atunayo work on the lower part and you're still good to go. And always remember when you're working on the brows, at the upper katikati, you just need to put some product and dab right in the middle so that it's all good. Anywho, now we're working on our eyes. Make sure the eyes are good. Prime your eyelids, you know. Then work with the first product that you like. And for this video, I'm going to be using a powder. This is what I, I I'm using the Fabulosity palette. I know, yeah, I've been using this palette. <laughs> Nigerian yangu so ntendelea tukutumia. So anyway, I'm mixing this with the with my own powder because it doesn't have the very light shade and I'm going over with this particular color. I think it's called Viola. I'm not so sure, but I really like it and uh, I'm using that at the corner of my eyes as my transition color and just blend it nicely. Remember ladies and gentlemen, if there are gentlemen watching, as long as you're going to be working with bright shades like a pink, your colors need to be harmonized. Like you don't want to throw in browns and, and pinks and purple and, and blue and green. Okay, you can even do pink and purple because they are sort of the same. They're in the same, you know, hues and whatnot. But you don't throw in blue and whatever if you want to have harmony, if that is the right word, yeah? I know there are there's a color palette and a color wheel that has the right you know definition but you get the whole idea work with the colors that are you know more or less the same and 
as you can see I managed to achieve that with the pink because we want to look approachable that is the main aim for this video Kimaliza paka mascara kama kawaida I'm using my Zara on mascara haijaisha so ni yangu nitaendelea kutumia mpaka aishe you know I always like to say you know there's no point of looking for a different product if you have something that really works also to be realistic this product still exists so I'm still going to use it until I feel they need to buy another one <laughs> But anyway, pack a mascara and be patient. Do two, three coats uh, or until you're satisfied. Next thing we're going to be working on our eyes or oh, the face rather, the face, the face. And I'm just making sure I've primed nicely. I use the Maybelline primer. Note, the primer that I use in this video is not the primer I would use if I'm going for a full face. Yeah, because for this particular video, all I want to do is just, you know, fill in the fine lines and, and that's about it. Ah, yeah. To Kimaliza, to me, Tengeneza Macho, we will lined our eyes because we want them to be bright. And now I'm applying my foundation. And for this video, I'm using again the Maybelline Fit Me. I have mentioned time and time again, this is a medium to full coverage. And to be honest, it is not a full coverage. If you're looking for full coverage, leave this product alone. This is a medium uh, uh, coverage and it's just medium. Like you'd still see, if you have a beauty spot, you'll still see it. But I like it because it is perfect for an everyday look. Like you just want a little bit, you know, you want your sm skin to be more flawless you know not too much not too little how about to cut but it is definitely not light a light coverage it is heavy it's not just full coverage so yeah product knowledge muhimu it's good to know your product so nime pack out two shades the lighter shade has gone under my eyes of course to brighten my eyes i want my eyes to look brighter and then the darker shade or the shade that is like my complexion has you know been applied everywhere so you can buy two products but if you like you can still work with one no biggie i like to use two products so that my you know under my eyes everything is good the rest you can see i i think this video would have passed it would have passed for like a you know do it yourself just look and learn only that personally i don't listen to videos that i don't watch videos that don't have audio i don't know i find them i find them a bit boring sometimes but yeah this video is pretty much you know just straightforward tengeneza macho tengeneza uso parker lips i'm using a lip liner and it's pinkish and then i'm using a nude product by zaron yes and i like that combination making sure my eyes are good i already like this look it's a hundred percent for me this this look is is what i can say you know hi guys i want to talk to you you know sometimes you can put on makeup and you become no one wants to approach you because you're like you look like you're so pretty <laughs> we don't want to come near you we, we're either staring or whatever so <laughs> you get the whole point yeah malizia kila kitu and you're good to go Thank you so much for watching this video to the very end. Kwaherini, 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 sana sana. Like, share, subscribe. Bye.